Hey everyone, welcome to the Solid Tutorials YouTube channel. In today's video, we're diving into a complete step-by-step -step guide for editing with Wondershare Filmora 14. Whether you're a beginner or more advanced, this full course covers everything you need to know from A to Z. We'll go over all the features and tools for professional video editing, and I'll share some advanced tips, tricks, and techniques to help you get the most out of Filmora 14. We've really gone deep in this tutorial, you won't believe how detailed we've gotten. From AI-powered tools to all the other editing features, we'll walk you through everything in a simple, easy-to-follow way. This course is broken down into 20 chapters, so you'll get a comprehensive understanding of the software. Let's move ahead to Chapter 17. In this chapter, we'll cover all of the topics you see listed on the screen right now. In this chapter, we'll learn how to create stunning split-screen videos using Filmora 14. It's quick, easy, and perfect for vlogs, social media, gaming, and more. Creating split-screen videos in Filmora 14 is super simple. First, go to the Template tab and click on it. Now click on the Split Screen option. Here you'll find a wide range of ready-made split-screen presets. Let's preview a few presets from different categories before we start using them. In the basic section, you'll see simple and clean split-screen layouts, perfect for everyday use. The social media section includes layouts designed especially for platforms like Instagram and TikTok. In the love section, you'll find romantic and wedding style split screens that add an emotional touch. The game section includes energetic layouts designed for gaming clips and streams. In the vlog section, you'll find creative designs like Polaroid frames and memory style split screens. The sports section gives you action-packed layouts ideal for fast-moving sports clips. In the comic section, you'll find fun and animated comic-style layouts that look like a graphic novel. The mock-up section offers 3D split screens showing devices like laptops, tablets, and smartphones, perfect for showcasing apps or websites. The festival section includes bright and animated layouts for events like Christmas. And finally, the end screen section gives you perfect split screens for YouTube outros, social media links, or business info. Now let's try out three different split screens so you can learn how they work. For example, I'm going to drag and drop a split screen from the basic section called Split Screen 25 onto the timeline. To change its duration, simply grab the edge and drag it left or right. Next, click on the clip in the timeline to adjust its border and size. Go to the video panel on the right and in the basic section, you'll find the border settings. Choose any color you like. Then use the size slider to make the border thicker or thinner. For more editing options, click on the advanced button. This will open the advanced split screen editing window. To add videos into the split screen layout, just drag and drop your clips from the media section directly into each screen area. The video will now appear inside one of the boxes. To adjust the size and position of this video within the box, first select the video. Then drag the slider above the split screen to zoom in or out and resize the video. For more precise control, click on the small slider button to open the video panel. Here, you can fine-tune the scale and position of your video. You can also rotate it if needed. Just below that, you'll find flip options to mirror the video in different directions. You also have access to all the editing tools I've shown you in previous chapters, so if you want to do deeper editing, those options are available. But for now, I'm going to keep it simple by adding videos to each split-screen box and adjusting their sizes and positions. Once everything looks good, you can go to the animation section to add motion to your videos. 
but for this example, I'll skip the animation part and just click on the apply button. Now our videos are placed inside the split screen. You can easily toggle the border on or off in the settings. And we can watch a quick preview. For the second split screen, I go to the social media section. Let's say I drag and drop a preset called social media split screen pack split 16 onto the timeline. To edit it, I double click on the clip, then click the advanced option. From here, I drag and drop videos from the media panel into all three boxes, and adjust their size and position as needed. Once done, I click on apply to save the changes. Now you can see the preview of this layout. It took just a few clicks to make this professional looking split screen. Now let's create one more. This time I go to the vlog section and drag and drop a preset called TV Retro Effect Split 03 onto the timeline. Just like before, I double click on the preset and go into the advanced settings. Then I drag and drop a video onto the TV screen layout and adjust its size. I repeat the same steps for the other two boxes in the split screen. And once everything is ready, I click on apply. And that's how you can create professional looking split screen videos in just a few steps. Stay tuned for more chapters in this complete Filmora 14 tutorial series.